Today we are rebuilding a bucket lift cylinder off of an LB75B New Holland. Taking out that set screw first, and now we are going to attempt to remove the gland. First thing you want to try is a spanner wrench. See if it comes apart easy, which this one does not. And then he's going to grab a pipe and put that on the end of the spanner wrench. See if that helps. which it does not. So we're just gonna try to jar it loose. So he's gonna try a chisel and a hammer, which doesn't do any good. So he grabs the air hammer, and again, just a little bit to knock it loose. And then once you get that first part broken loose, the rest goes pretty easy. Pull the rod out, bring it over to the vise to break that bolt loose on the end of the rod. And next is my favorite part, removing the old seals and installing the new ones. There's the metal clad wiper. And you'll see how this U-seal comes out in pieces, it's just totally shredded. And you see how that piston seal just kind of broke in two and People sometimes want to reuse their piston seals and you know that's fine but you can never really tell the condition of it you know and if you've already got it apart and done all the hard work you might as well just replace all the seals instead of trying to like cheap out and then you'll pay for it later and have to do the cylinder again. Now we are just cleaning out those grooves making sure that there's no old pieces of the seal and no dirt in there. Installing the new U seal and next up over to the arbor press to press in that metal clad wiper. And you can see the O ring and backup ring that go in next. Next, just putting the bolt back on, a little bit of Loctite on that. And because I did stretch out that piston seal when I was putting it on, we have to clamp it back together so that when it goes inside the barrel, it doesn't tear. Make sure you use some type of lubricant to put it back together. And now just screw that gland back in Make sure you get it back to the right position so you can put that set screw in. And you're good to go. Thanks for watching.